Well, a new report by the World Health Organization says just about all of us are breathing in unhealthy air. Some of the coastal bend have already been trying to figure out how to fix this. Tonight, our Iran Hami tells us where the concerns lie here in the coastal bend. We've had several neighbors that have moved out of our community because of health effects. And um, two of them based upon, you know, lung issues. Jennifer Hilliard is one of the co-founders of Ingleside on the Bay Coastal Watch. She says she has taken notice to the rapid industrialization over the last six years. After hearing that the WHO reports 99% of people are breathing in unhealthy amounts of particle matter and nitrogen dioxide, she had a realization. It makes me look in my own community and realize that um, we should probably be monitoring the air more um, in San Patricio County as the industrial you know, expansion continues in San Patricio County. Alida Castile with conservation group Chispa, Texas, says with all the refineries, residents on the coastal bend might be worse off than we think. The refining and processing the fossil fuels does have a high impact on our communities. And so that pollution um, does affect our health, affect our water and affect our everyday life. Chispa has been directing their efforts to promote the use of more renewable resources. For Hilliard and her organization, they want more air quality monitoring and to make that information public. The EPA does not have an air monitoring site in Corpus Christi. Recently received a grant for expanded air monitoring within our community. And so um, as a just grassroots organization, we're doing what we can to um, understand what is in our air. Hilliard hopes to use more air monitoring as evidence to pressure state agencies for change. According to the city of Corpus Christi, when you get those notices about hazardous air quality, all that information comes from forecasts by the Texas Commission on Environmental Quality. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Ron Hammy, Action 10 News.